Hey everyone, welcome to my channel. My name is Alicia, I'm a so crafty teacher. Today is a work with me vlog and I also will be showing you my new machines I have purchased and telling you about the features of each, um, talking about what I've been up to last week or so and and of course working on my Etsy orders. So stay tuned and I hope you enjoy this vlog. So you probably see some toys behind me. They're actually for my American Girl Dog Camp that I'm doing next week. This week I did a girls leadership camp and I also did a um, cheer and craft camp. So it was exciting. I got to bring my serger for one of our um, projects. We did a, a DIY tutu skirt and we also did a um, they made their own cheer bowls, they designed their own shirts, and also brought my heat press and was able to help them with designs for their cheer shirts. So it's been pretty cool. I can't complain. It's just it was exciting just to share the love of craft um, with about 37 girls this week in both of my camps, and we're gonna do more crafts. Um, for my American Girl Dog Camp. I also have a camp that's called Jumpstart First Grade and the Jumpstart First Grade Camp is to help students get ready for first grade, just um, get familiar with the building and just teachers in first grade, how first grade works. So I'm definitely excited about that. And so now I am headed to Mickey D's Today is my treat, y'all. Today is my treat. I have not had anything sweet but probably a handful of Reese's Pieces. And I've been drinking a lot of water, uh, a lot of water, a lot of juice, Gatorade. I do have a Sprite every once in a while. So, um, definitely excited to get my large ice caramel macchiato with whipped cream so getting ready to pull up at mcdonald's and have my treat yes can i get a large iced caramel macchiato with whipped cream hi good morning Okay, so I am headed back to the house where Hayes Custom Creation is located. Um, headed back to my studio. I am going to be working on Etsy orders. Like I said, I'm gonna show you um, my new machines <clears throat> and probably a little demo of how they work. And so I'm really excited to do a vlog. I haven't done a vlog in a long time, so get a little bit of everything. Me chatting with you. Definitely miss you guys. Um, I know that I need to do more lives, but I have to do them here and there. It's school year is about to start, but I will make sure I put out videos that I know you um, all can benefit from or just like to watch while you're working. Uh, definitely appreciate the love and support that you gave me on my last work with me video unbelievable I think I gained like three four hundred subscribers um, from that video and it's my top performing video so thank you so much for your continued support I'm not gonna be rambling on but I will be stopping to talk to you um, as I work and um, also let me know if you have any questions comment down below um, like subscribe and thank you so much and let
let's continue on with today okay so i'm back i'm about to clean up my area it has to be clean before i start i've been like doing different things with my machine so i got a little crazy with the fabric and look y'all i've only had this like what eight minutes it's so good and then uh had my water right afterwards Some strange reason I have to have, um, not strange reason. I always get a bottle of water, drink a bottle of water after I have coffee. So, I've been making things with this minky blanket. Um, just some little things for my dogs. I love to snuggle up with little blankets and lay on them. I love anything that's salt, so I made them some little snugglies. Everything I use is in my Amazon store. So if you just click on the link, it'll take you to all the items that you'll see me use today. If there's something you want me to add, please leave in the comments down below. So I got this biscuit. Like, mm, I need something filling. Right now I'm not feeling it, but I will once I get busy. So I'm sticking with my coffee, my iced caramel macchiato, and my water. Lots of tools. Have lots of tools when you, and lots of parts when you have a lot of machine. So, one thing that is on one pieces. I haven't even been through all the pieces. I watched so many videos on how to work my baby lock. A brilliant that I pretty much got on there, jumped on there, and made a little small, little snuggly blanket. For my little furry boy, but the rest of the unboxing. This is the walking foot. All my other tools, and also my machine. I can do twin needle. It has twin needle capabilities. More uh, needles, other feet. brush to clean off, keep it ma to maintain other tools, I have my book, but pretty much what I need is already on my machine. And I know people like, didn't you just buy a cover stitch? And then a couple of months ago, I bought my brother PQSL U1500SL straight stitch. So that's straight stitch. And I love it because it's fast. And when I just need to do simply straight stitch, I don't have to worry about changing the feet, changing settings. I just jump on there and do it. So, you know, making certain things that require only a straight stitch. I love my Baby Lock Brilliant because it does a little bit of everything. And it's computerized. And I don't have to throw the needle and the reverse button. I don't have to hold down. I mean, it's actually a button. Um, I'm able to do so many more things on there. There's so many features, so many different stitching. Like I said, it has a little twin needle um, thing. And I just been on this for a while, waiting, waiting, waiting. And what I've heard is like, when a new sewing machine comes out, wait like a couple of years, cause I think this came out 2019. They said, wait. Um, before you purchase it to see if, you know, is it good quality? Is it able to stand up against the rest of the guys? And it has, so. I've uh, been following this YouTuber Made Every Day. And uh, Made Every Day by Dana. 
and she can sew everything. And I'm just, um, I'm, I've always embroidered and made things, but like so obsessed with making things from scratch. Like I've made clothes for myself and accessories and I just want to do more with sewing. It's exciting. It truly is. And I know I teach full time, you know, I do several things, but my joy is crafting. My joy is sewing. Of course, along with my teaching, teaching and crafting are like my two personal loves. Like I have to have those two in my life. And so, yeah, that's what I'm doing. So right now you are watching. Yes, everything is not perfectly in this place. I'm telling you when I got my machine, I was just super crazy. I mean, look, I'll let you look over here. There. There's some things I need to take care of. There's that brilliant box that I need to get out of here. Okay, so obviously I have things I need to do. Um, I did want to show you this. I've been really decluttering my classroom. Not necessarily that it's cluttered, but things that I know that I'm not going to use, I don't need. I used to keep these, this in my class for like, this little toolbox. I use it for like all my different types of counters. You can see that I have it glued on here. This comes right off. But I'm getting ready to like put my assortment of feet in here. You can get it at Lowe's, Walmart. I have a smaller blue one that's still in my classroom for like all of my um, office supplies, staples, binder clips, pens, etc. So I'm gonna be using this. I'm gonna be using this little toolbox. And you know, I have so many different feet and tools and I know I can put them in my little drawers over here, but I love to just to have this I can go and just grab and I am gonna put I am gonna label these so that's my future part. all my little tools with me. I just took my, because I was pressing bows, and maybe I have a bow and example in there I can show you. Um, I just took my, my mini pressing pad. We're getting ready to get a, another one. I took my, my little Cricut. Take a video, I call it a Cricut Joy. This is not a Cricut Joy, that's a smaller machine. But it does bring you joy, it's the little Cricut Mini. I must have left the other bow, but one of our I got this from, I got this from Hobby Lobby. And I had some old sheets that, and they had like sayings and quotes and I let them go through those pre-cut sheets. I had bought them from the first edition company but during COVID, they went out of business. You know, all their sheets were like 50 cents, 25 cents. It's like, usually they run like three fifty, four dollars for a full design. And I've sold a couple with the pre-made design, a screen print, that's what I like, screen print to a sheet. And so I took, had like 20 or 30 sheets left and I let my campers, um, my campers, they get waved to go through, cut out what they wanted and then I just, Use my heat mat and I use this. The design, all designs were um, ready to go. So I did this one and I had one with like feathers and and team and they absolutely loved them. And then I saw some of the kids at their second camp or going to their second camp and all of them were in their bows and they were so proud. So that makes my crafting heart excited. Like I said, I was the one to apply the heat and they created the designs many other designs. Yo, this is the station. <laughs> this is my sewing station. Absolutely love it. It took my surgery machine with me, so definitely have to plug that in. I use it 
all of the time. This is my cover stitch. Gives you those clean hems. Um, you can have three or two stitching. This is my serger. So brother, brother, baby lock. You know, they're family brothers. This is, I love this. I haven't even used the, the feet or the pedal that goes with it. Um, because it's computerized. So I can start and stop in my hand and everything I've done on was just a start and stop button. So it was pretty nice. It's like actually touching one of my embroidery machines. So I love it. It's easy to use. It has a little lift uh, where you can lift up the foot so I can put it here. I also have one for that one. And it's awesome. So I'm glad I have two of these tables. My tables I have here both come from uh, Joanne. And a lot of times they're more expensive in the store, but they will honor the online price. So I would definitely, when you buy the store, you might say, oh, it's on sale, it's a good deal. Look online too. And it's pretty, it's probably cheaper. Cause I know these cheap tables were like half the price from online. And they were like, okay, we got it. And I'm a teacher, so I'm, I was able to use my teacher discount as well. So just put up all my bobbins. You can use regular bobbins with this one. This one you have to wind your own metal bobbins because it's it's pretty much, I mean, yes, it has the hard plastic, but it's industrial. It's fast. It does the job of doing a straight stitch. This little part is pretty cool because you can like hook the extra part right here so you do a twin needle. You can do the two color designs at once. Y'all, I'm excited. I watched so many sewing videos last night before I went to bed. So, yes, I'm working this Saturday morning. When we are, when you are a boss, you don't sleep, right? You know, I made sure I slept in a little bit today. And then got up and get my mind together for today. Plugging everything up. Yes, you do see my stairs. It's two floors. This floor besides the laundry room, there's additional bedroom and the bathroom. The rest of this floor is mine. It's, it's so exciting. I love the space. I did not start off with this space. My business grew my space. Had to as well. So thankfully, I don't have to, I'm thankful I don't have to rent another location to work. I can have all of my supplies here, do any of my jobs here, any sewing, any embroidery, any vinyl, any sublimation, um, all of that can be done in here. And gosh, you know, like I feel like I worked so hard for this and I've had my business since 2015. And I, I just feel blessed. I feel blessed. I'm, I'm thankful. Every day I come down here, it's not like, oh, okay, well, I got it. Now I'm just I'm like, this is my space. I'm blessed, y'all. <laughs> like, I feel blessed. I'm like, I'm thankful because I didn't always have the space. And it also allowed me to explore more in my craft. So it's been nice. About like, about patterns. So. It's like five, six thousand dresses you can make with this pattern. Then shirts, there's four different shirts you can make with this pattern. And also I want to do some uh, reusable, use some, do some reusable makeup wipes. So use cotton and then you use uh, soft microfiber. And these are dishcloths, but they're really good. The material is really good for like removing makeup. So. I might, I might make one of these today. I don't know. I'm just gonna do it on my surgery. 
Easy peasy, let me squeeze it. All right, so I have those things for sewing. There's absolutely nothing wrong with this, but it's a little dated. It's time for me to upgrade. I waited, I've had this a few years. This is the Singer 4423. Also, I love Baby Lock and Brother products, so. And it's just easy to use. It's computerized. Oh, this one isn't the model. And I love the ease of use I have. And yes, I still have my first sewing machine. You probably see it. It's the very first one. Okay. The little thing up here is broken, but I put my thread in the cup and the reverse. I think it probably goes like 600 stitches per minute. It's really slow. Basic features on here. Got the job done. Um, that's that free arm. They just take off both sides. And yeah, it's still here. So, first thing I want to work on is the adding the choo choo on two on this shirt. I'm gonna make sure I pre press it. I already have the designs. The only thing I need to do is gather the vinyl for this and cut it out. Let's say dreaming up, cut it out. So I know you've seen me make this shirt a lot of times, but today that's what I'm making. So we're gonna get to it and get it done. It's funny, one of my orders that I need to go out that go needs to go out today is a choo choo M2 and it's a Minnie Mouse shirt that's long sleeve. So I double checked and they want a long sleeve. And we're gonna make that happen.
I'm looking for a three T long sleeve. This is four T long sleeve that I believe I can buy in the you got it, one on one. Someone asked me how do I change the colors on the um, design. First, let me go ahead and type in the name, Sophia. How do I alternate the colors, Sophia? If I had to say, I did not. Okay. So really to alternate the colors, you, they're little green dots for each character. So for each letter, for each character, you have these little green, actually they're green squares. So I always start off with black and then I click on the dot, go to color, switch it to red. And I skip that letter, go to the next one. Click on that one and that's red. And then my last letter A is going to be red. And that's it. So you just click, choose one color, change the color, either a color you have already in your palette or you have to go and choose from threads. So this is the design that I'm using today. I wanna double check something. Baby Lock, Baby Lock, a oh brother, if you wanna sponsor. I have all of your machines from embroidery to sewing, everything. Oh, just kidding, but yeah, all of these are my machines. I am not sponsored by anyone yet, but I am very pleased with the machines that I'm using. Just hot glue it on there. This little one doesn't want to come off. Oh, ouch! A little lighter for right here. Let's clear this. This is a P-Touch. I've had this. Okay, so I've been Dr. Hayes for seven years. And then before that, because this is my 15, 16 year of teaching, um, this used to be in my classroom, Mrs. Hayes. You can get this from Amazon, Target, Walmart. But I literally have had this since the maybe first or second year of teaching. And I buy all of my little uh, tape inserts for like uh, off-brand from Walmart. I mean, sorry, I buy all my inserts here, just the laminated white labels. I buy all of those from um, 
Amazon get like a pack of 12 for $8. And I've labeled everything, so. So I've had the surgery, well, the singer and the brother that I have on the table. I have that. I have those the longest. That one I probably had five years. And the singer, my first one machine, I probably had five, six years. And then my singer machine, I've had like two years. Now I have, like I said, the surgery. And then I got the straight stitch, the brother PQ 1500 SL. Then I got the cover stitch machine. It's the cover stitch machine. Um, it's great for hemming any type of shirts, collars, um, everything. I've made a skirt, I hemmed it. I've made some shorts, I hemmed it. I made a shirt, like all kinds of different things. And it gives you that professional look. And so, and I use my surgery when I am creating things like, created like, uh, waistbands, crunches. Um, I want to put two pieces of fabric together for making a shirt. I can either sew a straight stitch um, or I can come over to my surgery. I use my surgery probably the most. Very profitable in my opinion and very much worth. Now my baby lock, which just got me so excited. And I love that everything is digital. I don't have to try to figure out if my stitch length is long enough or wide enough. So I'm excited. We have all these features here. You have the force to start and stop button. Let me get some fabric. This is a like first part of the skirt. I actually use my inserter to and close it and then I did a top stitch. So I made a casing just for my surgery. All right, before I do that, I'm gonna go over there and... Um, do you sew? Do you make clothes? What do you do? Like, do you... I love a little bit of everything. Um, the handmade, the embellishment, the custom. Um, I love it all. I used to screen print back in the day. I do not anymore. And um, yeah, let's go check this out. It has 16 minutes left. Oh, should be plenty of right, so I'm going to you to check out the features of my baby lock be genuine collection it's all about it's all about how do you feel when you are sewing and I feel brilliant you know I feel great I feel happy this sewing machine does everything like I said I'm going to show you I know it's hard to hear but I'm going to show you some of the features I'm actually gonna cut this. So, see here, this is what my cover stitch did. So it creates a beautiful line. So you can use three or you can use two. And it just has that professional look. This is at the bottom of one of my skirts. I've made several. And then this is what it looks like on the back. And that's when I use my cover stitch machine here. Um, I can show you what it's like when I use my surgery. So. So, Serger creates that finished look. So I'm gonna show you what it does with the Serger. I said, this is what I did with the cover stitch. Put the professional hem, and then 
I'm gonna show you what it's like with the serger. Let's see that again. Lift down. And that's your surgery, surges and ends. Um, you have like two pieces that you're joining together. Cause you cut and you like to join together. Yeah. And so these two will cut. And say so you are making a shirt and these would part the sleeves. You'll have right sides together. Hold them like that. And lift this up. Put it down. And bring it around, let it cut it. And see it will join them together. So that way you have, I, mean, I miss a little spot. And that's the good thing about the surgery. You can go back. You need to make sure you are where you need to be. You can go back. Okay. Straight. Down. Okay. Now it's surge. So if this was, if I was doing a sleeve, I'll surge this part and then I'll flip it over and look at that. Seamless, flawless. Okay. So let's check out Baby Lock Brilliant. Okay, I have brother, baby lock, brother, brother. Back there, brother, brother, baby lock. So, you know, we're keeping it out in a family. What about this? I have this new lift. It's down here so I can, I don't have to reach around to pull up my little presser foot. Okay, so I have my two pieces. And I just can soak these together. So I'm gonna use my knee lift, move it with my knee. Look how much space you have. Like how much fabric you can come to this. It goes pretty high. And so I'm gonna put it down. Hands free. And I have it lined up together. I'm gonna just select just a straight stitch. I need my J foot and I already have it on there and everything is already threaded I have my bobbin actually let's look the bobbin is good so I have that piece I'm gonna put it here and down and I have speed, like um, slow, like it's slow, and then like a medium speed, and this makes it go really, really fast. And I don't have to use uh, the pedal that comes with this. I can actually just hit start and stop. But I have to disconnect the foot controller. So it's disconnect foot controller. So I disconnect it, and now I can start just by selecting. I'm going to bring it over here since I'm going to be controlling this and just stitches and get a spin. And then if I need a back stitch. And when I'm done, I hit my scissors. Again, I don't have to reach around the back. I can lift it up with my knee lift. Okay. Ta-da! And the stitching is magnificent. Let me show you my straight stitch. Brother, semi-industrial machine. Industrial machine. Uh, the PQ 1500 SL, the straight stitch. Everything seems to be already pretty. Okay. Lots of extra strings here. Okay. Everything's set. 
ready to go. I'm just gonna turn this back on. It is on. I put that on the heater. Right. And I want you to see how fast. I'm gonna let you see how fast this goes. All right, and does have a little knee lift that I can add to the side. Uh, have not put it on this one yet. So, oh, let's make sure it's not dirty. And my baby lock machine is automatically dirty. This one is somewhat, there's still, Things you have to do so it's kind of like an automatic threader so you put it down and you put it between the little two notches i just put it right above the top notch Also, I love about those no, super fast, and also what I love about this, it also cuts your thread. So, thread is cut, cut, and there's like three, like uh, four different levels of how you want your feed dogs to be. How you see mine on green, I make sure it's up here on green, and that's what I use. So, I'll show you one more time. I think the camera was a little off. And I always, I always press this button, it keeps my needle down. Anytime I stop it, it keeps it in the down position, which is great because if I need to take it, I need to turn it, going through the edges, I don't have to worry about trying to readjust it. And, I mean, absolutely takes no time to do it. Alright, the shirt is done. Usually I do everything on that table, but today I'm just gonna do it here. Trim all my pieces and then I'll put that up. So thank you so much Crafty Scholars for hanging out with me today. I hope you enjoy this vlog, um, traveling with me, working with me, cleaning with me. And also I got to introduce you to all of my machines, talk about what they do and why do I have them? I love them, of course. Um, I appreciate you. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you in my next video. Ciao Crafty Scholars. <music>